Hi, I'm Miles McBain, and I'm the National Director for Scripture Union England and Wales. At Scripture Union, we're committed to sharing God's incredible, life-changing love with the 95% of under-18s who aren't connected with church. And while we're providing training, resources and support for churches and individuals through our Revealing Jesus framework, we know that it's only through prayer and trusting in God that we'll see his kingdom come in these younger generations. Join me now in praying for them. Father God, we thank you for your son, Jesus Christ, who died and rose again to restore relationship between you and your people. Thank you that this gospel truth is a living reality for every one of us praying here today. We thank you for the life you give us and the joy of serving you and sharing your love with others. We pray for the churches in every community across the land. Lord, would you soften our hearts towards the children and young people who live nearby, and particularly for those who don't know you. We pray for compassion as our churches try to understand the challenges and difficulties faced by young people today and for creativity and boldness as they reach out to meet those needs and demonstrate the difference Jesus can make in everyday life. Stir up the hearts of your people to serve you in accompanying the 95 on their journey of faith. And we pray for the children and young people themselves. We pray that you would be present in every area of their lives. We pray that their homes would be places of nurture and growth and that they would know you with them in school as they learn and make plans for their future. Keep them safe in their communities, protected from gang culture, drugs and other negative influences and protect their emotional and mental health as they face the challenges of life every day. And most of all, Lord, we pray that the young of our nation would meet people around them who can introduce them to you. We pray that you would be preparing their hearts and drawing them to you, that they would hear the truth in their friends' stories of your love and that they would respond to the invitation of a life lived with you. And we pray that you, God, would be glorified in and by the younger generations as they know you, worship you and serve you. We pray that the 95, being rooted and established in love, may have power together with all God's people to grasp how wide and long and high and deep is the love of Christ and to know this love that surpasses knowledge, that they may be filled to the measure of all the fullness of God. Amen.